Previously on Bring It. Did you want to go in the first place? Okay, you didn't want to go. My issue is not with you, my issue is with Brittany. I really honestly feel like Christiana was being held hostage to her aunt. Christiana is welcome to come back, but you, I don't even want you outside on the porch at all. Here's the girl. Look at you. go read. Damn show is. She's a hypocrite. You allowed to be here? Wow. I'm allowed to be here under circumstances. It's crazy for me because the dollhouse has always been my second family. Family's first fight and argue, but families also communicate too. But I'm glad we had the top, but guess what? You still can't be out there on the porch. And tonight, the challenge is gonna be coming from a very special guest. Wait for it. Oh my God. What's wrong? She has worked so hard on you. Y'all just build these girls up and you bring them down. What the hell is going on? Now, at this point, it's either put up or shut up. I don't know what the hell's going on in the dollhouse that would make Diana change her mind just like that. But hell, she probably just missed me. But what's going on so different this week? I'm not really having to say exactly, but you can't be on that porch, OK? OK, I got it. Thanks, Brittany. Thanks, Mr. Tory. I'm back on the porch. Yeah. Hey, make it money. Yeah. Make it, make it money. Purple Diamonds, oh, and this Tanisha from Memphis Prince and Tigerette. Look who's back, Brittany. I heard she thinks she run this porch. But look right here. This is my unbothered face. These new mamas. See, we just put y'all in the category. Y'all together. It's a new time, a new day. Nothing about this is a game. This is dance. Word on the street, this Prince and Tigerette lady wants her daughter to be the next captain. But read my lips. We not going anywhere. All right, you guys, so for the last couple of weeks of the competition season, we have seen Neva. <laughs> We've seen Miss Sharkita with the explosive. We've seen Prince and Tiger Reds. But going into this week, there is no competition. We need to take us a break. All right, yes! Yeah! Yeah! Wait for it. We're going to take a break from competing, but we're not going to take an actual break. But this week, you guys are going to be given a challenge. The challenge is going to be coming from a very special guest. And the very special guest is... Broadway musical Kinky Boots, and he is on tour now with his own very special music and production tour, Straight Out of Oz. Straight Out of Oz, the concert is a live version of my visual album that came out earlier this year with the same name, and it is the perfect hybrid of a Broadway musical meets a live concert. This is all happening so fast. You guys ready for this challenge? Yeah. You are gonna divide yourselves into two teams. You're gonna come up with choreography for my song, Low, featuring RuPaul. It has to be a creative concept, a choreography from the beginning to the end of the song. Because the dancing dolls are used to stand battles and this week there is no competition, Diana and I decided to make our own stand battle, but this time it's dolls versus dolls. And I'm gonna choose one team to dance live on stage with me at the concert in Atlanta. Ooh wee. Let me get this straight. Our teams are going to have to choreograph our very own routine, and one team is going to get to dance live on stage with Tajik, huh? That has to be the most amazing thing we've ever done. 
So I really need you guys to step up. I love things that are out of the box, that are super creative. This is one of my favorite songs. Uh, I'm gonna be on stage in drag with you guys, like in a full costume, and I need something, yeah, I need something that's gonna make the crowd wake up. For this challenge, I want each team to choreograph what they think is the most impressive thing that they can possibly do, but most importantly, it has to properly tell the story of The Wizard of Oz. The best way to impress me is to do your research. I'm a theater person. I love a great, solid story. Todrick is going to pick who's going to be the winner. It is not gonna be me. It is not gonna be Tori. You are on your own. Now, I'm leaving this entire challenge up to the girls. They have to come up with their own choreography and their costumes using the theme of Todrick's tour straight out of Oz. Moments like this come once in a lifetime. I hope you see the window opportunity that is standing right in front of you. It's me. It is. It's you. you. I'm more excited than you. He's yes. Yes. It's some new flesh now. Nah. Yes. All I can hear is Todrick Hall, stage performance, Broadway, faith, 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 and more faith. You have two team captains, and the two team captains are going to pick their team like dodgeball. Y'all play dodgeball? Yes. OK. So team captain number one, Cameron. Come up. Yeah. Yeah. who the other captain gonna be. You know Princess has captain capabilities, so you know, I'm just saying. You just saying what? You just saying some Team captain number two, Christiana. Yeah. <laughs> what you say? Don't call the comeback. Oh, so this is the reason Diana called me back to the porch. But you could be sure me or Christiana won't disappoint. Is my niece about to dominate that floor? You know what I'm saying? All right, Cameron, you got first pick. Go. Michaela. OK. All right, she started out with Michaela. I feel like that's a strong pick. Christiana. Kendrick. Yeah. My team off to a good start. Mimi, you better try to keep up now. We ain't got to keep up. We already ahead. Faith. There go, Faith. Yeah. yeah. I'm picking the best dancers and the best stunners so that I can impress Todrick with all kinds of tricks. Deja. My strategy is not to only have heavy hitters, but also girls who would be really creative for my routine. Canary. <laughs> princess. Well, it's looking like Christiana shows Princess. Rydney, I don't know how long you're going to be back. But while you're here, make sure you take some notes. Ooh. Pipe down, lady. You need to do less jaw jacking and more taking notes because you about to get schooled. Star. All the twins separated, OK. Angela. Angel. So both of the twins are separated. All right, well, Todrick has to go. He took the time out of his tour to come and to issue this challenge. The challenge has been issued. It has been laid down. Hey, so we're going to see honey. who's going to slay. Yes. Who's gonna slay? Who's gonna die? I'll see y'all this weekend. Thanks. Bye. Bye y'all say thank you. Thank you. I know y'all are gonna kill it. I'm excited to see it. Now, to help you out throughout the course of the week this week, I'm gonna give you guys two mentors. So, Cameron, your mentor is going to be Mr. Tori. <laughs> Christiana, your team mentor is a surprise. So Team Christiana will be leaving and going to a different practice location, and Team Cameron will be standing here. Now, I'm giving the girls a mentor, but make no mistake, they alone are responsible for this entire creative. So Team Christiana, get your things. We have a bus outside waiting for you to take you to your location. All right, Cameron girls, so this is all you. This team is your team this week, so what do you want to start with? Have you thought about a theme yet? In the music video, he has a lot of Wizard of Oz stuff, so we're just going to go with that. Gotcha. My strategy is to focus more on the dance part rather than the story part, because I want to make sure Todrick is impressed by our moves. All right, well, let's put it together. Yay! Guess who's back? Since we have four groups, we can just do it all in one account. Oh, okay. 
This is a great week for the girls. Todrick Hall wants the girls to perform in his upcoming show. Y'all will prep on four, four. and then y'all will prep on six. In order to decide who will be performing with him, we split the girls into two groups. There's Team Cameron and there's Team Cristiano. Both squads will be coming up with a Wizard of Oz themed routine, but only one will be chosen to perform with Todrick Hall. All right, let's see this group up here. Let's see. I'm extremely impressed with Cameron's choreography and her ability to get the girls to really work with her. They're kind of coming along really fast. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hello, hello, what's going on, Dan? That's what's up, what's up? Well, well, well. Look who drops from the sky. Star, Sky, and Sanjay's dad, Selena's ex, everybody's lovable teddy bear, Mr. JJ. So we got Star and Sky on two different teams. And of course, you know, Selena, she torn in between the two because she can't be in two places at one time. But you know, Selena don't call me, you know, ask me, you know, can I go down? So just to make sure, you know, that I'm there for the girls, then I gotta do what a daddy gotta do. Is that something, baby? Come on now, shoot. That's what I'm talking about, what you got? Hey, parents. Well, they say you're the man with the plan. My plan starts with y'all staying quiet. Okay. Because they're extremely concentrated right now. This is my one warning. Don't yell towards the dollhouse. I'll lock it if I need to. Ooh! I know y'all had Miss Diana in there, but I didn't know you had Mr. Diana in there, too. Showing no mercy. No, I can't show no mercy. I'm an entrepreneur, so you know you can be sure I'll f with no co working. So y'all can go five, six, seven, eight, one, two. Y'all wanna do that? My plan is to knock Todger Hall out with some heavy duty measurette moves because that's my specialty. So after one, two, three, four, oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Y'all get down. Seven. How does split end like this? I think with Todrick Hall being who he is, with him doing this tour of the eyes, it needs to be more, like higher. When you do a production, everything has to be bam, 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 but it still has to be good. I don't care if you got Toto out there, that need to, it needs to be bigger. I know Christiana is trying hard, but she's leading the girls into a hardcore majorette dance. She needs to start thinking outside the box and start thinking about the theatrical aspect of the performance. Well, I'm trying to stay still. I know Kayla's the mentor, I know. but she said she was not here to help with choreography. Right. But she I don't feel that right. way. I know Kayla knows what she's doing, but she's supposed to be a mentor and not give any creative direction. But I didn't hear any rules say that DDP can't, and I'm not about to let Christiana lose this competition. Y'all, I don't mean to stop y'all. Right now, y'all just dancing. And have y'all watched Tyger? Y'all know he's very over the top. If y'all just dancing, it's not gonna win. So, Brittany gone. I, I really hope she don't go in there and mess the girls up. Shake your booty, do your little stuff, you know what you do. Now, how the hell are you gonna help Christiana and you can't even dance? So she just always have to put her two cents in, hon, I see. Yes, all the time. She gotta make it about her some kind of way. Yeah, true. These girls have barely practiced for an hour and Brittany has already something there to help them. Well, I hope her helping doesn't cause our team the chance to work with Tajri Hall. Brittany done got on my nerves and I just, and she just got back. So that was just the beginning. I done heard all the stories about how she, you know, like to run everything. Yes. But that's not why I'm here. What have y'all been doing? Uh, working on the dance, which is kind of cleaning everything up. Okay, start from the beginning, let's see. I've given Team Cameron a good chunk of time, so they should be ready for me with this choreography. Looking for attention. Now, I'm seeing really good choreography, but I expected that from Team Cameron. And Todd goes really specific about making sure that the storyline was an integral part of the choreography. Okay, so right off the bat, the choreography 
goes really well with the music, but you guys have to sell it. And if I'm watching this, I'm just looking like, hmm. So Coach D said our routine was like, hmm, like blah, boring, bad. You need to think about what are you doing with your story? What is the theme of it? What's the concept? What is it? Camera, what is it? You gotta think, what would Todrick want? We're dancing to his song. I know I'm being blunt, but you know what? Camera can take it. She's been with me a long time. And she's off to a good start, but she's gotta take the advice that Todrick and I are giving her. All right, so I'm gonna go check on the other team. Y'all carry on. Okay. Good. Hey, camera, come here. Pretty please. I can see that Cameron's really hurt by Diana's critiques, but it's up to me as her mentor to make sure that she stays calm and does not have a fit. Self, okay? Keep your chin up. Chin up. Up. All the way up. All the way up. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Feel Do you out. feel overwhelmed? Don't. I'm frustrated with Miss Diana's critique because we've been working hard on the choreography and I've been putting this all together by myself and so now it feels like it's not good enough. You're the captain of this all, okay? She was only given critical <laughs> criticism, okay? You can't let it take you down and you can't let it put you down. You just have to shake your head on it, whip your hair, let it go. I see Tori talking to Cameron, look like she crying. She has worked so hard on this. It's a time when you have to just back off. My daughter is not a robot, and stomping all over her like that is not gonna help her do good work. Y'all just build these girls up and you bring them down every time. Every time. Y'all bring them up, bring them down. Bring them up, bring them down. Like double up the first 20 seconds so y'all can start back on the right camera. Yeah, we can okay, do so that. Okay, so let's do it all together first. We have been practicing for a day now. I know it's taking me a little time to get this thing wrapped around my head, but I do think we're making progress. So let's try it. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and. All right, hello, hello. Hello. Hey. What have y'all been doing? Working. Now here I am, finally at Team Christiana's practice location, and I'm really eager to see what the hell they're gonna do. Looking for attention. Someone turn up the lights. Become the main attraction. You can do whatever you like. You know you got. I for Team Christiana to be, um, you know, a little bit further on in the choreography, but I'm not gonna worry about that because I know with Christiana being new to this whole leading the team situation that they're gonna move a little slower. There are no animation parts. This looks just like a major routine. You didn't utilize the words and the song. You didn't utilize a lot of what he's saying. This is the Wizard of Oz. Where, where the hell are they? Where's the Scarecrow and the Tin Man and Dorothy and the Lion? Where are they? I gotta be able to see it all. You're missing the Todrick in it. I think it was too soon for Diana to barge in into practice and give those critiques. But I'm hearing what Diana's saying, and I think she's probably right. Like, the, you gotta play, have fun with this. Be playful with it. Oh, boy. I hope it don't throw the girls out. All right, keep up the good work. I'll be back. Well, I know the first night of practice last night was a little bit rough. 
I admit, I got a little heated last night, but it's only because I know how hard these girls work. Miss Diana coming in, making all these changes, and then, you know, we trying to get the dance together, and we only have a certain amount of time. So I'm like, I'm trying to figure out what is she talking about. That's true. So now I have to figure out what I need to add. Miss Diana always finds something wrong with anything, and it could come off in a mean way, but then the good thing about it is that it only makes it better. But it's still me. The day is going to be a good day. You know, I know last night was a hard night at practice, but it was just the first night. I think today is going to be so much better. Yeah, I'm a little worried because Miss Diana came in and she talking about the concept and the story and the theme, and I don't know what I want all those things to be. Well, you just need to think about Tajri. Think about the whole concept of what he doing with Oz. So we're going to take what Diana said and we're going to use it. Don't get so caught up in the negative things she said and think about the positive of it. But I think tonight, y'all going to get it together. Well, it's like when she was talking, my heart just kept not We was done. We, we were done. Like three we were days. done. Last night, Diana came down on Team Cameron. But before practice begins, I suggested that we have a little powwow and a little chat to just make sure that everything goes well today. I think we just gotta, gotta, gotta be animated and then. Yeah. And like she said, just, he is real animated and stuff. And then the yeah. routine is like, it's yeah. upbeat. Nothing but animation. Yeah. We have so many dance styles and moves that we've been working on to start over will put us all behind. Instead of creating a whole new dance routine, we decided to make our moves more animated and elevate our stunts. Just like any moment that we have, just make it. Have y'all thought about the thing? Yeah. yeah. Yesterday's practice was rough. I let Brittany take over, but we got direction from Ms. Diana, and as the mentor, I'm gonna make sure we stay on the right track. Give me the storyline. It's like a dancing doll version of Australia Eyes. So we thought about it on the bus, and we decided that we are going to do Wizard of Oz characters. Kijanae is going to be a good scarecrow, and Deja wanted to be Dorothy. Princess is going to be a good tin man, and Makai is going to be a good lion. And of course, I'm like Todrick. Half bad and half good. Like, we could do all types of genres. So each character is going to be a different genre. Yeah. Show me how your characters move. <laughs> Dorothy should move, and I'm thinking she needs to be light on her feet, maybe a little jazzy. Of course, everybody picked me to be the lion. Lions are fierce, and that's exactly who I am. My scarecrow has some hip hop in her. Okay, so that's the characters. This is a great idea. Yeah. I think once you pull all that major and stuff out, uh -huh. it's gonna it's gonna look ten times better. But 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 animation three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Y'all don't sickle, because this is going on real deal stage, okay? And this Todrick will see it and he'll chop you for it. So make sure that your weight is on your big toe. Got that? But I see Cameron is watching, mm -hmm. so she's giving them, she's letting them know, I see y'all, y'all serving. She didn't change anything, so that's a plus. I know Coach D has come down hard on them, but I'm glad they're making adjustments instead of blowing the choreography. I mean, because it's pretty amazing. Nothing was taken out. They just need to take her notes, captivate. And ride with it. Right. Ride with it? What you mean, ride with it? Are you serious? Am I the only one out here seeing that this ship is going down? I mean, what is the thing? Who, who the hell is Dorothy? Who got done in the scarecrow? But you know what? Who I'm the lying? And I'm the lying. I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, the dancing look good, but I can't tell what the hell is going on. Let, let, let them do what they do, just worry about you, gotta keep your cool. Hello. Hello. 
Both Cameron and Christiana have picked out their costumes online. I hope they fit, because there's no turning back now. Cutesy. Excited to see how this is gonna go. Ah, didn't mean. Hey. How you doing, Miss Good, Good. Well, how you well. doing? What brings you into town? I'm here to pick up a box. A package? Okay. I have one for you. These are some interesting choices. Girl, there you go. Don't worry about what's in my box. This is classic Mimi behavior trying to psych me out. But Team Christiana, we don't play that game. But you know what? I don't even think it's gonna come down to the costumes with this competition. I guess we'll see come audition time. Well, I guess we will. Yeah, we will see. <laughs> May the best team win. You already know it, like always. Mimi, see you in Emerald City. Help. Take your little box. Don't let the house fall on you on your way there. Mine bigger than yours. Make sure it all fits. Mine bigger than yours. I'm just super duper nervous. I know you are. I'm I'm right along with you. It's the final day of practice, and we head to see Tardrick tomorrow. Now, my job is not to step in and choreograph this for the girls. My job is just to kind of push them in the right direction. Let's see it. Some of what Christiana's doing, I would love to go in and just kind of rearrange it, but that's not my job for the week. I can't coach them. I've got to step back and let them do this on their own. When the girls finally do the dance full out, I'm like, yes. These girls looking like now, they want to win this. I like the choreography, but I still feel like some parts of it can be better. Because I know what the other team is doing, you guys are gonna have to make sure that you push. And if you wanna win, you're gonna have to fight for it. All right, well, I'm leaving. See you later. I'll see you in Atlanta. I am so nervous. It's a lot to prove, a lot is waiting on me, and the pressure is on. Look it up, guys. Na, 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 na. So Team Cameron is looking good, they're looking happy, and then bam. Lord, here we go. Now I'm back, and I've given Team Cameron a good chunk of time, so they should be ready for me with this choreography. Come on, no mistakes, ladies. Come on, hey, I need you to get it. They got faith. They got faith. Yes. They got attitude. They got all right. Like. Looking for attention. Someone turn up the light. Looking at the girls, I didn't really understand the theme, but it was still very, very, very entertaining. I felt like the choreography was great, creativity was great. I love the tricks that they did, but they still have a whole lot of work to do. All right, everybody come up. Y'all are going in the right direction. Like you have really, really good content, but y'all gotta sell it. If you wanna win, y'all gonna have to sell it. I'm really nervous because this is a really big opportunity and we really don't want to miss this chance. Don't get comfortable, because I'd have been to the other side over there and I saw what they have too. When you're going up against someone else and you know your opponents, think about who's over there. Y'all are going to have to perform. I would say now Cameron's team is neck and neck with Christiana. Christiana's team has gained some steam over the last day. And I can't wait to see what both of these teams are going to get. I cannot wait. So, I'm leaving. ladies, welcome to the Atlanta Symphony Hall. Are you guys excited? Yeah! It's D-Day right here in Atlanta. And these two teams have been working really, really hard with only one of them 
performing tonight on stage with Todrick. I can't wait to see what you guys have in store. You guys are gonna get 30 minutes to get ready. When you come back, me and my team will audition you. Y'all ready for it? Yeah! All right, well, time starts now. Y'all better not fall while y'all running! <laughs> <laughs> oh, who's wearing the boa? been working so hard for this. Everything is happening so fast. It's like a circus. Don't forget your energy. If there's any moments that you get tired, breathe, let it go, and then keep going, OK? Watching Cameron this week, this is probably the most proudest that I've been of her. She's put her heart and soul into this routine, and I feel like they're ready. Have fun, show a lot of emotion, show a lot of facial, just show everything for him to be like, ooh, y'all so extra, and I love it. Where's the red ribbon? It's almost your time. Fingers crossed. OK, y'all need to make sure that y'all play your role. Do not forget, look at them. And if you cannot look at them in their face, please don't look down, look above their head. I just want y'all to go out there and kill it. I guess we pulled it together. At the end, y'all look really good. This week was a ton of work, but it was really cool because I was able to see the routines from beginning to the end. Just perform, y'all. <laughs> All right, come on, y'all. Let's pray. Let's pray, girls. The girls are competing against each other this week, and even though they're competing against each other, we're still one team. So I'm going to pray with each team. Lord, we thank you for this amazing opportunity. Lord, we thank you for the gifts and talents that you have given each and every one of these dancers, Lord. And we ask that you touch their bodies as they touch the floor, that no hurt, harm, or danger will come to them. Help them remember the steps. Help talk to love what they have put together. And no matter whether they win or lose, let these girls have a good time and enjoy and be able to fellowship in this amazing opportunity and this amazing experience. And in Jesus' name we pray, amen. 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 Both of these teams have worked extremely hard this week, and now at this point, it's either put up or shut up. Our story is a little bit different because all of the characters will be portrayed by different people. So instead of, you know, just one person being the scarecrow, it's gonna be a group. Cameron's strategy was to pick out not so much Wizard of Oddish, but to try to get a, you know, kind of a feel of the costumes. We have a scarecrow, they're blue for the blue jeans, and instead of hay, they're gonna have feathers. And then we have the ten men. Of course, they're gonna have on silver because ten man is silver. An amazing, amazing job. I already know. The bar has been set. Wow, Team Cameron did an amazing job, and it looks like Padre enjoyed their interpretation, which was kind of abstract. Now I'm starting to worry if Team Christiana's interpretation of Wizard of Oz is too literal. Not only do we have all the characters, the Tin Man, the Lion, the Scarecrow, and Dorothy, we also have the good and bad witches. And of course, me, I am Taja Carl. Cameron did good. That means Team Christiana is gonna have to come down here and leave it all on the floor. Looking for attention. Someone turn up the lights. Become the main attraction. You can do whatever you like. You know you got. I had my doubts in the beginning, but they took the criticism, they came up with a concept. They got some real competition, don't get me wrong. But I feel like Team Christiana got a real shot.
team. You can break character now. <laughs> Great job, ladies. Awesome. Very different concepts, very yeah. different styles of choreography, so... Well, wish us luck, baby. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Both of these teams did a really good job, and being a judge, it's gonna be a really tough decision. I literally oh. don't even know where to start, and I have so many opinions, but I want you guys to tell me what you thought first. Okay, I loved the interpretation. I loved that they went a completely different direction. I love that there were so many styles of dance in this, because there was like a technical, they did like an across the floor, they did like almost a river dance footwork section. And my favorite part was the, the skip. Line. The yeah. line. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Integrated and the, yeah. the jump split line. Oh, was fierce. I would have like, flipped this, the table. This yeah. number showed a lot more yes. personality than yeah. the other one did. Cameron's team is amazing. They had so many great moments. I especially loved when they all skipped down the yellow brick road because that is one of the most iconic Wizard of Oz moments of life. On the other hand, the costumes were a little bit iffy. I wasn't really sure what characters they were supposed to be representing. And part of the challenge was making sure that you told the story. What did we think of Christiana's group? I loved it. Yes. These girls. Yeah. were committed from start to finish. And when they were starting out, when they walked in, they had different, like, they were d committed yes. characters. Yeah. Like, each one was a very specific thing they were doing. Christiana's team rocked the house, and they really brought the music to life. I loved all the characters. Cameron's team did more impressive stunts, and the choreography, the difficulty level was much higher. And I think Christiana did a really good job of telling the story and properly conveying the story of The Wizard of Oz. So, this is just a really, really difficult decision, but yeah. are we all in agreement? Yes. yes. Bring back my girls. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, ladies. This was not an easy task and something completely out of your usual wheelhouse, but you slayed the mess out of it. With that being said, we can only choose one team and there can only be one winner. So, drum roll, please. can only choose one team and there can only be one winner. So, the team that will be joining me in the cast of Straight Out of Oz live tonight on stage is team Christiana. Thank you, thank you. We're back and this winning train is just going to keep on chugging. Not only did I want this for me, but I wanted it for my team. And we, um... Oh, she's so sad. She feels like she failed her team. We just worked really hard. We had all our dads together. Everybody was all on the same page. And then we just didn't get it. Team Cameron, you guys did an amazing job. This was such a close call and such a difficult decision for us to make. I'm so grateful. Thank you guys so much. Cameron did a really great job with her choreography, and normally your captain is going to be the one that probably you would think that would win going into every competition like this. But Christiana did an amazing job, and you can tell why she's Cameron's right hand. The girls are now about to get a taste of what it feels like to be a professional performer. It's gonna be a lot going on. This is gonna be something completely different. Like, it's gonna make you lose your damn mind. ATL, make some noise for the dancing dolls! Looking for attention. Someone turn up the light. Time! the main attraction. Hey! never thought that I would be here leading my team to dance with Tyler Hall. But this makes me realize that this is where I want to be. This is what I want to do with my life.
Whitney is gonna be something because she's gonna never let it go. But with that being said, seeing a fellow Smurf have this opportunity makes it okay. I guess. Watching the girls on stage is amazing. They are killing it, and I'm really proud of them all. Oh, hell yeah. That one over there is mine, and she's killing it. <laughs>